I mean, you held a funeral for your pop music. I did. Right? Um, <laughs> and, you know, and that's, and then you've debuted all the rock versions. But, I mean, really, are we really saying goodbye to pop music forever? I, I never say never because you never know what will happen. But I've just been really influenced by rock music and... Um, it's what I have fun performing live. Like, I don't have fun dancing on stage right. anymore. Did you, when you came up through the Disney system, did you feel pulled away from something that you had a natural gravitation towards, which was rock music? No, I actually, I stopped listening to rock music for a couple years and was like really leaning towards pop stuff. And that's why... I started performing more pop music, but um, it's also, I think, subconsciously what I thought people wanted to hear from me. Uh huh. And so, it well, they clearly did, by the way. Yeah, and there's thank no, you. There's no shame in that. Yeah, no I mean, shame. Yeah, it was just the path that I took at that time, and then when I started. I kind of, you know, I got sober and I was reevaluating everything in my life, right. including my music. And I was like, what makes me happy? Like, that's the most important question. And I was like, what makes me happy is listen- listening to rock music and performing rock music. Um, Heart Attack is another one. Uh, I love this. Thank you. Uh, so this good. works. I, I. It must be so fun performing these songs oh, yeah. in a new way. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's so fun. And you can belt just as hard on the rock versions. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Yeah. Did you have to get a new band? I did get a new band, and um, it's an all-girl band. I'm really proud of them, and they're fire, so That's um, it's fun performing with them. 